Hey y'all, it is Wednesday the 30th. It's my day off, so you already know what time it is. It's the Riff Day. We are going to go to the Goodwill Bins. There's one in Midlothian, so we're gonna go check that out. We're also gonna go to the Goodwill and Short Pump. And yeah, so just those two for the day. I'm really excited about the bin because I've never been before. So I really hope I find something I'm excited. I really don't wanna get my feelings hurt, but I feel like I might get my feelings hurt. So fingers crossed that it goes well. Also, I have been vlogging today for a day in the life video. So also check that out. Yeah, but we're gonna get into this little thrift session, y'all. And my sister's coming with me. Stay tuned. We're at Goodwill number one. Let's see what we can find. Awesome, silly. We didn't find anything at all. So this is gonna be a real unsuccessful thrift trip. That's how I'm feeling. Fingers crossed we find something at the bins. I'm Walmart. Yeah, so Walmart. We're going to Walmart. Y'all will see that on the other video. So boom. Oh, this thing is crazy. So we're out here at this uh this Goodwill Center. I I don't know what's going on. It looks like a lot. It's huge. It's big and also Yeah. Yeah. It's no. Outlet auction donations. It did don't look like it. We just be, we're about to be walking around this facility. <laughs> I don't know y'all. We don't know what's happening y'all. Okay. So we gotta drop to the back. <laughs> I guess I'm driving to the back. This center is huge. So it has like, it's like an office building and then it's the outlets which is what we're going to the bins and then there's a donation center that's somewhere back here too are we gonna walk or are we driving back there i don't know how to get there, <laughs> I don't know how to get there either oh additional park additional park is up here so we're gonna drive back there the outlet is right here Ooh, that color change yes so we made it back here i'm excited oh, we should, we, we should grab a shopping cart just for this thing? No. <laughs> for good luck? Um, yeah, for good luck. So so it'll conjure up us finding some actual stuff. Awesome, silly. All right, y'all, so that was an experience. So I got two pair of jeans, a top, and a, a clock. And I paid $4.74. I will show you all the stuff when I get back home. We're gonna take a thumbnail and get on the road. All right, y'all, I'm back at home. And I'm gonna show y'all what I got. So, first is this Winnie the Pooh and Tigger clock. It's mad dirty, but it was cheap. So whatever, it's real cute. I figured that I can put it on my bookshelf. It'd be mad cute, like a little trinket. 
what are they, Sophie shorts? Or soft shorts, I don't know. But um, little cotton shorts. Uh, I have a couple of uh, the mesh ones. And I just wanted these, they're mad cute. I was sleeping and stuff like this, so. Yeah, I got these. This right here was the first thing I saw when I walked in there. It is this, um, it's this little Mickey polo. See the little, that's a little um, Disney tag. So it's a Walt Disney World little polo. It's so cute. It's a size medium, I think, in kids, but whatever. We're gonna try it out. I don't know if these are gonna fit at all. These are some uh, 514s. They're kids. They're in a 12 Husky. So we'll see if I can pull them off. They do look mad wide though. We'll see. These are uh, 7-Eleven skinnies, also Levi's. They are in a light wash and a size 28 waist. So we'll see how these work. I might just de-stress them. I don't know. So that's what I got. Yeah. So the bins, that they were a lot. It was just, just hella bins all over the place. Um, so when you walk in, they have just rows of bins with clothes. And then on the opposite side, there are rows of bins with like, um, household items and things like that and then you go in the back and then they have like the electronics so monitors keyboards mouses all the things but i was i was in the clothes i was in there and every time that somebody an employee brings out a new bin when i tell you those people flock like seagulls they be in there they be all through them clothes i'm like so I was just standing there watching like, I wasn't ready for this. Cause they was all through them clothes. Just let me, let me show y'all with the clothes. This is what they were doing. So I got the clothes right there. That's what they was doing. Just ripping through. Like there was like, so they're like large men. So there was, they would be like, like 10 people surrounding you, all just, I'm like, I'm not ready for that. That's, I wasn't prepared for that. So I was just, wow, this is what we doing? Y'all, wow, that's crazy. Let me go over here though. Yeah, next time I'll be prepared. Also, I, I don't think I'm gonna jump in cause mm -mm. that's too much, they be doing too much. But do I really want to go back? Yes and no, because it it was a nice experience, but also like if these pants don't work out, is it worth it going through everything and and just wasting all that time? Is it? I don't know if it's worth it. It was mad cheap though. So so clothing is um. 159 per pound if it's between uh zero and 20 pounds so i had a uh, 2.53 pounds of clothing so i paid 402 for the clothes and then for household items it's uh 79 cents a pound and then i had 0.57 pounds so it was only 45 cents so my total was 474 so yeah y'all that was my experience at the bins. Also, that first Goodwill, mm, trash. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and then check out my Depop Instagram link tree all down in the description. And yeah, we gone. That's it, that's all.